We're going to start early in Velasquez's career. We're going to start with the water carrier of Seville. This is painted when Velasquez is about 20 years old, and this is really one of the first genre scenes that we're seeing. Now, when it comes to art, when you see a depiction of everyday life, that's termed a genre scene. And it's a depiction of anything from everyday interactions to scenes to domestic uh, imagery or narratives. It's where you get away from some of the grandiose ideas of history or religious painting. And we've seen this before with paintings like Giovanni Arnolfini, which depicts a marriage. Now, when we look at this piece, the detail lends credibility to the scene. Here we see the clear glass filled with water. We see the jug sitting there. Again, possibly containing, I mean, obviously it contains water, but that top jug may well contain water. The hands are very, very detailed. What we see are plebeian figures, dramatic light, the influences of Caravaggio. But it goes a little bit deeper. It's not simply a scene of a water carrier. In other words, someone who brings water into Seville and then sells it to passers-by. But rather, what we're seeing is class interaction. We have this rather oddly well-dressed boy, and we have the very poorly dressed water carrier. The water carrier would be poor or working class, and someone whose job it is to haul this water around all the time and then sell it on the streets of Seville. But it's the glass that gives away the game. So the boy has given him a glass, and a glass is, well, an expensive item, much less an item, the sort of thing that you would carry around with you on your person. It's a status symbol. It tells us that the boy is something more, that the boy is perhaps a member of the aristocracy or a member of the upper classes in some way. We have the ceramics depicted with incredible realism, but they stand in stark contrast to the glass because the poor, the working class, even the middle class would primarily use ceramics as opposed to clear glass. The problem is clear glass is very expensive to make and expensive to blow. It takes a lot more resources, so it tends to be a class signifier here. The boy also seems to be almost looking down on the water seller, and the water seller doesn't even want to make eye contact. He's avoiding any form of interaction that might be seen as negative. Now, of course, Velasquez is about 20 when he paints this, so there's some awkward passages. We have this odd person in the background looking straight on at us in this very frontal pose, as opposed to the profile of the water seller or the three-quarter pose of the boy. And he's just sort of looking out. And we get a sense of, you know, him drinking in the background, but he doesn't really need to be there. You can imagine a young artist looking at this going, well, I want to add something else to it. And in fact, Velasquez will paint multiple versions of this painting, trying to create sort of the perfect image of this genre scene, which isn't just a genre scene, and frequently they aren't.